welcome to my February favourites. I'm actually using my brother's webcam at the moment, so if the quality is wrong or my lips are out of sync with my voice, I'm really sorry. But we're going to get going. Um, my first favourite is Topshop Jewellery. I am absolutely loving all their jewellery this month. Um, my ring is from there. I bought this the other day, which is a beautiful um, necklace, uh, bracelet which like clips off and it's got little gems and it says love on it, I like that and this gold necklace as well and it's got a little birdie so I love Topshop jewellery, it is a bit more pricey but I don't think it's any more expensive than accessorise and actually their jewellery I think is a little bit more up to date so I like that um, the second random one to get it out of the way so I'm really loving arrow words at the moment is it just me, or are other people addicted to doing arrow words? This is what one is. It's like a little puzzle. I, I doodled. But it's like a puzzle. Um, and you have to fill it in. I am addicted to doing these. It's bad. Okay, so hair care. At the moment, I'm using the Matrix Biolage um, shampoo, which is the hydrating shampoo. So it's the purple one. This is the best shampoo I have ever, ever used. I will be doing a review on the shampoo and conditioner. It leaves my hair so clean. Like, I've never felt my hair this clean before. It's absolutely amazing. I love it. And for baths, um, I'm not really a massive Lush fan. Um, I really like this, which is the coconut... An almond nourishing bath milk by original source you can see I've used so much of it this makes you feel like you're bathing in milk oh my word your skin is so soft after you have your bath it's it's just absolutely gorgeous and it bubbles up like no end it's, it's just the most amazing product it's really cheap and you know it's easily available um, it doesn't really smell too much of coconut because I don't like coconut personally but please add this to your shopping list next time you want a bath you will not be disappointed and if you are you can tell me and be like <laughs> um okay again getting on staying on to skincare um I really like the Clinique seven day scrub cream this leaves your skin feeling very very soft it just takes off all my dead dry skin and leaves my skin beautifully soft it doesn't irritate me I love it and this is actually a sample size and it's quite big there's a lot of product in it um, 30 mils and you only need the tiniest pea size amount to to exfoliate and I got this free from the counter so I recommend maybe going in and asking if you can have a sample um, Again with Clinique, the clarifying lotion, so this is like a toner, so I use it after um, taking my makeup off and this is like the final sweep which helps get rid of all my dirt um, and tones the skin, helps to reduce pores, just generally lovely really. Um, so yeah I like that, that's really good. Um, this is my second bottle, yeah, it's good. And the last skincare is the, um, oh no, I haven't got another skincare. I haven't got another skincare. Nail care is the nail varnish that I've been wearing for ages and loads of people have been commenting me on. And this is from Nails Inc. And it's in the colour Pembroke Close. There it is. Obviously, I always have chipped nails, so, you know, they're going to look a bit tatty. But... If you paint them, like, this is such a gorgeous colour for spring. It's pastel. Um, it's kind of bright. It's funky. You can wear it with anything, really. I love it. Okay, then getting on to cosmetics and makeup. I'm really, really loving um, the Urban Decay Eye Primer, the Eyelash Primer Potion. See? Um, I bought this on 3 for 2 in Boots the other week in London in... Um, Carnaby Street, there's a Boots there and they have a Urban Decay little side section and they have three for two but it's just a white primer and it's got lots of little fibres 
on in the pro in the product and I really find that it helps um, make my lashes look fuller longer I'm gonna do a review on it when I get my HD camera um, in May because it's my birthday then and just to show you because it's a wonder product I'm not joking one it's gonna be my holy grail primer for my eyelashes I love it that much um, okay, then getting on to the number seven highlighter. If you saw my hilarious video with my friend Jo, where we, she, oh, just funny. Um, you, you saw I use this to show how to achieve that glowy skin. I'm also going to do a separate review on this product because I like it that much. But it's just a highlight product. Very soft, very shimmery. Um, you only need a little bit on your apples of your cheeks to achieve that glow I really like that because it's about £13 it's in the number 7 spring collection which is new at the moment oh I have got another skincare sorry um, it's the usual um, Clinique take the day off makeup remover for lids, lashes and lips now Pixie 2 Woo um, talks about this all the time it is in the makeup trade normally thought of as the best um, eye makeup remover it's an oil based remover though so you've got to be a bit careful if you don't like that greasy um, texture maybe wash your makeup off and um, wash it off before you apply your makeup but it is amazing and um, this is a sample size as well I don't buy full size things when I can get them for free so yeah go to the, your counter and just ask for one don't be scared um, if you want me to do a little video on how to do that then you know how to ask for three free things at counters and I can do that for you as well my dog has heard somebody next door so he might bark okay two things left three things left I like the sleek eyebrow pencil this is in 191 brown and I use this every day I think it costs about three pounds but it's just a really good natural brow pencil um, it's matte obviously it matches exactly my brow colour and I love it and it's only cheap I really wouldn't just buy drugstore brow products like especially pencils they're all the same you've got to find the colour that suits you um, then for eyeliner I really like the elf waterproof eyeliner I've actually entered their competition um, to become like an elf girl so if you see that video make sure you comment on it and be like yay you must win <laughs> but um, I really like this it's a pen tip applicator and it's very very black and um, really really good if you are new to eyeliner because literally just lie it down and draw it on so it's really really easy and it only costs £1.50 from elfcosmetics.com so I'd recommend that and then finally um, for eyeshadows, I have actually depotted my MAC eyeshadows into a palette. Um, I've got a couple of palettes now for my own personal use. So if you want me to do a video about that as well, let me know. Because I, I can show you how to depot them and why I did it. Like why I think it's actually better for me to have them in a palette. But um, yeah, these are my... This is my Holy Grail MAC palette. Like my perfect palette. Like it's got all the colours that um, I would want in them. These are the ones that I reach for the most, so I really like that. I won't go through all the colours now because that would take a while, but I do know them off by heart. I'm very excited. I'm like, oh, and this one is... So yeah, but yeah, MAC palette. I'm really glad I actually depotted all my shadows so I don't have them all individually. And that's it. That's my favourites. Um, I hope that's given you some ideas obviously there's going to be quite a few reviews coming from them but um yeah let me know any comments comment rate and subscribe and i'll see you soon bye